They might be trying to figure out how you can try Android on your specific iPhone. Now, what do I mean by this? Well, basically within our iPhones, we have the ability of basically downloading web applications and using them as a, you know, basically like standalone apps. And it's kind of cool. To do this, what you're going to want to do is you want to go and make your way over to your you know, Safari browser, make sure it's Safari, and you want to go ahead and just type in on Google, try Android on iPhone. Now, when you do that, you're going to see these things come up. But right here, you're going to see this test, you know, try Galaxy on your iPhone little panel that comes up right here. All you're going to want to do is open it up just like this. And from here, once you're on this page, you can go ahead and click on the share button at the very bottom. And what you're going to want to do here is you want to click add to home screen. So this add to home screen option right here, you want to click on it and you can name this whatever you want to. So in this case, we'll just name this that. And then we'll see this specific new application come up on our home screen. It's not a complete app. It's like a web application, which is still you know, very good. It still works completely fine. So what you could do here, it's very awesome. You can go ahead and you can pretty much just click on you know, this specific page and open it and watch what happens. You get into this panel. You can click next. You click next, just keep clicking next until these things go away. And now look, you basically have a full on, almost like a full on Android version of a phone on your specific iPhone. So after this little like brief pop-up, it will kind of just give you a little bit of a walkthrough, which you really don't need if you've used a phone before, but that is it. And now look, you kind of have the ability of trying out a kind of an Android system on your iPhone. So it's not completely great. It works kind of decent, which is actually kind of surprising. These buttons at the bottom also work, which is very surprising to me. And, and that is kind of it. So now you can go and use this. And also if you swipe up, you get into your application panel. Now these apps, most of them are not they're basically all generic, so they don't completely work. You cannot make a phone call, but they all kind of work in a way. So you can go and click home button. You can click here. Hi, As you can see, it's like kind of freaky a little bit, but that's another thing you can do. But you can even make your way over to your settings, which is very funny. So you have that type of capability. It's honestly very cool, but that is an option that you have. So that's basically the main way to go and do that. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comments section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.